the fire. Yeah, if and then when you're lagged in that, he grabs you, and or or you could force smash, I guess. Yeah, if he's close enough. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's like a guaranteed grab if yeah, he exactly. hits you. Yeah, and and it lags for a long time. You stay there for like two seconds yeah. straight. Build damage. But so it's, it's harder to like uh, to set up like combos within uh, teams since yeah. uh, with projectiles and so like, you know, teammate can come help you. We'll see. Well, let's see. I feel like he's gonna go in the stadium or the battlefield. So that's a Holy and King Kong second yeah, match. Yeah, second match. On the first set. Now they're facing Doyle and Watt. Doyle and Watt. Doyle and Watt. Doyle and Watt. I think it's the second round of the winner's break. Yeah. Doyle. I think it's Doyle. I'm not sure why. Doyle. Doyle. So. I think Kanye and Ole are pretty gonna ban Yoshi, like I said, it's a bad stage for uh, his uh, for a strike one. Yeah. So, stay there, pretty nervous right. stage. Let's see how it goes. Charizard, I feel like Charizard is gonna come combo pretty easily against uh, in the night, but usually like big characters have a really hard time in teams because they get hit by Charizard, everything. Charizard right now is doing a good job on yeah, that. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, uh, putting a, a good fire now. Mm -hmm. You know, I have to pressure on Charizard and recovery. The only thing about Charizard, no, which uh, is a bit, a nice bit, uh, uh, I see, that's bad. He's, he has a big character frame like Bowser again. Yeah, so, yeah, like I said. He can get combo easier than, yeah. than Ness, I guess. Yeah, 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 like I said, big characters are not uh, hard time team. Oh, nice combo. Oh, on that, that pressure from Holy. See that, uh, he's, he has, uh, he seems to have a lot of experience in PM with Metal Knight. Yep. Exactly. Uh, I don't know if uh, maybe Swarm could have DI the first hit maybe and, and didn't get like six or seven hit cut. Uh, I don't know. It seems he was doing the anyway. I'm not sure. Like I said, like, I play PM, oh, but there's a few that character that I don't know much about. So. See, that's one of the big killing moves from Charizard when he throws oh, like yeah, that. Oh yeah, yeah, sure. That's almost a, guaranteed kill even if you DI. Yeah, you you, you must not uh, DI away because if you die away, you're gonna die on die the, from on the, the side. Yep, so you just side. don't DI okay. anything. You know, you just then you're gonna start on here. So oh, Charizard is out of stage right now, let's see if Avizor can help. Avizor didn't go for the edge guard somehow. I feel like with Avizor you always need to be aggressive on edge guard since it's his, uh, his force, so... Yep, and Holy goes for the kill with the Avi. Let's go. Edge guard opportunity on Ness. Like, see, I think, I think when you have uh, edge guard opportunity, like, uh, all you should let the King Kong go outside of stage. Yeah. Because and keep Avizor is so good, uh, it's like a Jigglypuff. Like, yep. In midi, like when you play with the good jigs, you let the jigs go uh, outside of stage to get the uh, aggressive edge guard. Exactly. Especially against uh, Charizard and uh, Nez, they have like predictable recovery, so you can you can predict where they're gonna go. Yep. And Avizard covers so much ground in the back here that you see that. Uh, nice the away on the down throw. Like you can get the up B if you want the away. And as you can see, uh, Ivysaur can uh, throw. I think it's the B move, right? You can, throw, you can throw the B move and control it so he can go further and then maybe use it for edge guards or doing damage outside if he doesn't want to go out. Gonna use the spores. So, right now it's a pretty close match, one stick B for the green team. Uh, you see, Oli uh, tried to go for uh, aggressive edge guard and get it, but you need to go for that and go for uh, those kind of things. Yeah, there's a slight advantage for green team right now, but it's still close. It's only one yeah. stock lead. Nice, nice combo. Oh, nice Lago combo by, uh, by Oli. Oli. Again, and like I said, uh, Mitari is really good to get the uh, early kills uh, on the top. Up first to yeah. be it's a uh, pretty strong uh, combo with the finisher. Maybe he's going to go up up again combo, and go. do a laser beam. Oh, uh, yeah. They should try to like chain a tornado to solar beam. It would be like pretty funny. But the tornado is not that that good in PM compared to draw, so he's probably not gonna use it. And now the two stop uh, things. And now Ness swing his best. It's been pretty hard. You see? Uh, I don't know if Ness can absorb though the laser beam. Oh, nice beam. Over. You see, Oli Oli is trying is going for aggressive edge guard, which is really good since 
Like, but uh, it works. So far yeah, it works. yeah, that's why I'm saying it's really good. You need to go for those. Both characters can go for Igor Savage Guard since uh, Mitai have multiple jump yeah. and Avisor has a. And they're both so hard, like, they cannot be really punished. Because yeah, that's why I'm saying. Goes so you need to together. go for this Igor Savage Guard with exactly. character. Like, exactly. Oli's doing a pretty good job. Sometimes he gets punished for it, but you need to go, uh, go for them. Yeah. But uh, King Kong, uh, it seems like he's not aggressive uh, enough on edge guards. Maybe he, want, he wants to make sure that he doesn't get. Uh, yeah, but it's, uh, you have mm -hmm. such a safe recovery with Avisor that yeah. you can go for them and like. Not That's something edge. you know, maybe that he doesn't know. That's yeah, I guess. Because you used to play Avisor for a long time. Yeah, you, you just go for those, uh, those back arrows so they say it covers mm -hmm. so much space. Yeah. It's, uh, you can get games early. And it's the same kind of. Uh, you have a kind of, of move that, like, like a Ganon up, up air, right? Like when you go up there with the back air with Ivysaur, it just pulls down the target. Yeah, and yeah, it's yeah. Hard for it them to recover, uh, and you just kind of sweet spot afterwards with the vine, and, and you're good. Yeah. And even if you miss it, you're like, like you're gonna come back faster than them on the exactly. edge with a tether because it yep. goes so fast. So it's it's really so safe. Automatic sweet spot, right? With that. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Unless really unless the, the the guy like edge on you and you. you you have a little bit, a bit of lag to uh, get up on stage, but I mean, it's still uh, pretty safe. So uh, I would like to see uh, King Kong for go for more aggressive edge guard. But I'm not sure who he plays in uh, in Brawl. Maybe he does he never really play a character that is, can get aggressive edge guard in Brawl, so he's not used to do, to do it in PM. So. so we have it the casual. Pretty uh, neutral stage. I feel like yeah, I feel like um, Avizor. I feel like Avizor character as well. He yeah, went yeah, to he Zelda. switched to Zelda. But I feel like Avizor and uh, Mitalai has an advantage with platform. They like better uh, at setting up combo with yep. up air for Mitalai in platform. So exactly. Yeah, uh, it's a pretty. I, I feel it's gonna be a pretty good stage. And now Zelda, can he recover? I guess here now he seems to do more like. 1v1 on each side. Yep. Like Oli and King Kong, they don't go for the 2v1 when they have an opportunity, so. You have the weakness in the team player now, I see. Oh, that pair did a lot of damage. Oh, yeah, you have an opportunity to like team combo on Ivysaur. Yep. It's really important to get those when you have an opportunity to combo 2v1 some, somebody. Like. Yeah. Oh, and goes uh, first stock. Yeah, it is. Oli. Yep. First stock. Oh, that's an air. And all the others are quite high percentage. It's so like, that's a very good recovery. Uh, no, oh, did yes. it. Oh. Well, he protects himself with the B move. Yeah, you can always up. do that. That's why it's very so yep. safe. 2v1, you time. see it? 2v1 on uh, Charizard while uh, Zelda was like stalling with uh, his pro uh, projectile. Oh, oh with the beam nice seed. Well. Uh, yeah, yeah, nice seed. Uh, uh, like, they nerfed it since the more, more recent version, but yeah. it's still pretty uh, useful uh, yeah. tool. Well, it's a killing move that actually reach away yeah. without. It used to go uh, to, be, uh, uh, to be faster before, but, but it's still, still pretty uh, yeah. useful. Too. It's it's a killing oh, move that doesn't like expose you, you for uh, the eye away and I trade or something. So I think it would have died with either the eye. Now maybe we're gonna see uh, King Kong goes for the laser beam, uh, maybe faster this game. Doesn't want to hold uh, the light for minutes. He seems to be really yeah. hesitant with it for yeah. some reason. So nice force smash. Because at, at like 60-70%, does it guarantee uh, a kill someone if you get sort of like 70%? Uh, it depends on uh, which kind of character, but yeah, you can get like around those percentage, 60%. It's a very strong uh, kill. Nice up tilt by Zelda for the kill. It's one of our best uh, uh, kill moves. Uh, that is very strong. To be one on Charizard while uh, Zelda is recovering. Good job by the green team. And Charizard is gonna have a hard time dealing with 2v1 pressure, so you really need to abuse uh, that pack. They just have to. Uh, to be one of Charizard, on, yeah. Uh, they're doing a, a much better uh, job at 2v1 in, in, in this game. Yep. That's the thing. If, if the other one tries to recover and you know you won't be able to edge guard him, might as well just focus all your energy on 2v1. Yeah, yeah. Build damage, maybe go for a kill. Yeah, especially Zelda, it's, it's just like a. She, to, she takes a while to recover, so just. Just to be one the other guys. Uh, best option. Oh, uh, you could have went for an up throw. Charge Yeah. yeah. Uh, nice up to kill. Uh, so now we got uh, a slight stock advantage for the green team, but it's. Uh, they're uh, both well, hypers in the show, we'll never a... know. You know, maybe. Uh... Yeah, it's. Oh, so and pretty... the Joe, oh, yeah, gets the kill. Uh, it's still pretty close. Maybe. And Oli goes for that big oh combo you see up here, up here. Yeah. Like a, it's like a, 
kind of Jigglypuff up here, like, combo, but uh, with more hits. Yeah, and you have a finisher with that. Yep. See, so, green team, it's it's pretty even, except oh, for the nice, first damage. That's a big combo with that, man. Oh, nice up, Swiss butt up smash. He had the Swiss butt smash. Uh, he's gonna uh, yeah, run the... Yeah. It's pretty, uh, uh, pretty uh, convincing uh, victory here, unless the levels are some uh, miracle. Uh, uh, with slow characters, it's so hard to uh, deal with 2v1, so you're going to have a hard time. Yeah. Especially with your Zelda. Yeah. You don't move that fast, so it's hard. You cannot just change target and go for a kill or something like that. It's pretty predictable. Oh, he could have went oh. for a combo on that. Oh, he, what? Yeah, yeah, that was good. Right. Missed it. Is it down smash? Yeah. Not sure why he's trying to down smash though, because uh, he doesn't do much damage with Zelda. Ah, try to win for the down throw to a B. Yeah. If you're putting the, the eye inwards or I uh, doesn't the eye yeah, away. When, like when you get a sweet spot with the odd B, it does yeah, a lot of damage. Yeah, it's, it's a killing blow for yeah, sure. Yeah, it's a pretty good uh, kill move on either. Yep. But a very strongest one after uh, Swimming. He's nice. trying to beam, getting HP charge. back. Uh, is he gonna try it? Uh, no. Oh, he missed it. He might try it again. Oh, oh he got nice it. Nice A yeah. lot of damage. So and it goes game two. I think we're next on stream. Yep. I need to go to the bathroom first. So, so, so 